So today, I'll be showing you how to transfer files from your iPhone to an Android phone wirelessly. Now, obviously, we know Bluetooth does not work between iPhones and Android phones. And also, we know that Apple's AirDrop feature is only for Apple devices. So today, I'll be showing you how to AirDrop in quotes files from your iPhone to your Android phone. So for this one, you're going to use a very nifty web tool. It's called snapdrop.net. So open a browser on each of the phones, on both the iPhone and the Android phone, but simply go to snapdrop.net, as you can see. So snapdrop.net is a website, and go to that URL on both phones. So currently, I'm using Chrome on Android and Chrome on iPhone but you can literally use any browser. Now, of course, before you open these two websites, both phones have to be connected to the same Wi-Fi network. So as you can see, both phones are connected to Wi-Fi and it's the same Wi-Fi network. So that's very important. And because both phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi, this phone will detect this one. As you can see, it's going to give it a random name. And also this one gives this one a random name. But as you can see, the iPhone detects there's an Android phone close by and the Android phone also detects there's an iOS iPhone close by. So to send files from the iPhone to the Android phone, simply tap on that and then you can choose from either your photo library or you can take a photo right now or even choose from files. Let's go to the photo library and pick a photo or two. So let's select that. A couple of photos, maybe three. Maybe let's try and look for a video. So I have a couple of short videos here. So let me add all this. And the iPhone will prepare those files and start shipping them to the Android phone. So as you can see, the files are being transferred here. So here are the photos as they come. So if you choose multiple photos or multiple photos and videos, it's going to send one by one. And once it's done, all you need to do now is come to the Android phone and tap on save, and then tap on save for the next photo, save again, save again for all the files. Also, if you send many photos all the time, you want to uncheck this so that it stops asking you to save each photo before downloading. So go ahead and just tap on save once, and all the files will be automatically received on this side. So you can tap on that, then you can be able to access all your photos and videos. So these are all the photos and videos that I've been sending from my iPhone to the Android phone. So let's try the other way around. So sending files from Android to iOS. So once you open the browser again, you can see they're detected. So let's tap on that and then go to either camera or files. So hit files. And inside files, let's go ahead and try with this specific file. If you tap on the file, as you can see, it's going to be received on this other side. So it works both ways. So from Android to iPhone and from iPhone to Android. So that's basically how to airdrop files from iPhone to Android and from Android to iOS. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.